Hamilton's Catholic School Board is facing a new controversy tonight over the use of a racial slur. A school principal in Stony Creek has admitted to using the N-word and apologized. But parents say the school board should be doing more to put a stop to racism in its schools. Al Sweeney reports. The latest incident happened last Thursday at St. James the Apostle Catholic Elementary School in Stony Creek. The principal says she overheard students using inappropriate language. In telling them not to talk that way, she says she inappropriately used a racial slur as an example of what not to say. Parents say she used the N-word to students. They were very distraught, very upset. Um, they, uh, they couldn't believe what happened. The principal, Elena Minacucci, wrote an apology to parents. In it, she says she used an offensive racial slur and recognizes the immense pain and distress it may have caused the students. She says it was inexcusable and an oversight in judgment. Ryan and Don McGinnity say their children at the school were upset by the language aimed at schoolmates. They see what these children are going through and they don't think it's fair and they don't think it's right. We've raised our children with certain beliefs, especially in the Catholic school board, to love everybody and to not hate. I've, to, I've explained to the children, you use that word, that's hate language. The Catholic school board is investigating. We take all allegations very seriously and we'll deal with them uh, appropriately and where necessary, whether it's through some form of discipline or uh, you know, off of professional development, education, mentorship. But these parents say the principal's apology was sent only to the parents of grade five and six boys and should have gone to the whole school, along with a faster response with continuing conflict at the school. People at this school, this community and the school board need to know exactly what's happening here. Um, I don't think it's fair um, that she only issued that apology directly to those boys. In April this year, the same thing happened here at Bishop Ryan High School. Sources told CHCH then that a senior staff member used the N-word while trying to stop students from saying it. The school board says people have to realize the impact of their words. One of the challenges uh, for us as a society is to come to understand, uh, you know, the hurtfulness of using particular language, even if we think uh, that we are using them as a tool to educate. The principal in this latest incident says she's working to eradicate any prejudice or biases she may have or that may exist in the school. Al Sweeney, CHCH News.